Hello everyone, greetings and blessings to you and your family. Welcome back to my channel, Cooking with Marcia. I trust that you are experiencing your best day. Today, we'll be doing a riff on the famous avocado toast, okay? We'll be replacing the bread though with sweet potato. Um, instead of bread, we'll be using sweet potato. There are a variety of sweet potatoes, but my choice of sweet potato today is that red skin Japanese sweet potatoes. These are less sweet than the others, they are creamier and they're less starchy. So that's the reason why I'm using these potatoes. Japanese sweet potatoes, um, or some people refer to as a Japanese yam, are excellent source of vitamin C, vitamin A, and dietary fiber. Hence the reason why I chose that particular variety. Okay, what do we need to do? We need to wash our potatoes thoroughly because we'll be leaving the skin on because that will mimic your bread crust. Then we're going to cut our sweet potatoes in rounds. You know, it's probably easier for you to use a knife or a mandolin, depends on, depending on how you feel, whatever you feel comfortable with. And you want to um, slice those to about maybe a quarter to half an inch thick. So you're getting that really bread uh, texture and size. Then you place them on your baking sheet and place those in your preheat oven. Uh, your oven should be preheated to about 400 degrees and you want to bake it for about 30 minutes or until they are cooked and, and toasted. Once that's done, then we're ready to place our topping. And our topping is going to be very straightforward. It's a chunky avocado salad. It's uh, easy, but delicious. You once, once this is done, you can use it as a snack item or for lunch or for dinner, your choice. So what do we need for this um, avocado um, chunky salad? Obviously, avocado, um, cherry tomatoes, green and red bell peppers, a red onion, some some sort of greens. I like to add greens into anything that I do. So I had some kale and I had some callaloo that I'm adding to um, my chunky avocado salad as well. Then I'm using um, I'm using a medium sized um, lemon and lime. Some fresh herbs and my herbs I'm using today are going to be parsley, basil, and some dill. Cloves of garlic some hot pepper, you know, I like my pepper. <laughs> so I'm using um, some um, scotchy, some scotch bonnet pepper, uh, sea salt and ground black pepper to taste. And all we're gonna do is chop and combine all those ingredients and create this salad. And then of course, for garnish, we're doing some sesame seeds. And that's it. That's your avocado toast that is topped with a chunky avocado salad. Now, you could make a guacamole, you could make your uh, avocado um, salad smoother, you know, crushed, but this is just my style and this is what I do, but this is, this is the whole idea is that um, if you cook or prepare your own plant-based food, it gives you control over the quality of the food that you're eating and the sustainability of your new renowned plant-based lifestyle. So don't be afraid to just go in there and make this recipe your own. Add whatever you want, make it smooth, make it chunky, make it your own. You can do this. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the next episode. 
and um, peace and blessings to you and your family. I wish you guys are having your best day. All praise and thanks to the Most High God, the Father, the Creator, my Lord and my Savior, Thoth and my Father. Thank you so much for blessing me with the opportunity to present these recipes to your people. Peace and blessings. Thank you.